Hey guys, so we got a new dog fence up and what we're gonna do is put up some electric inside so that we are not dealing with dogs digging out. So that's gonna be our next steps here for the next little bit. Hopefully you guys appreciate it and enjoy. Thanks for watching. Dean Family Acres. So, we're getting a few things done here. We got a T post here, T post there, T post there, one all the way down. That one at the end, there was a root or something. And then we're also running them this way. So, we got one right up there by the fence gate. And then we'll put a couple down this other side and be able to connect the electric to keep the dogs in. So we almost have the fence finished here. I'm gonna add one more post in this line here. It just seems to be a little bit loose. Everything else looks pretty good. Um, only other thing we gotta do is get the tractor in here. We've got one ditch where I, when I had the trencher, I put a ditch through here to uh, possibly run water and um, electric. And I'm not gonna put it over there uh, in that exact spot. So um, I need to fill in that at least inside the pen. And other than that, it's just running an extension cord for now to get the charger over here and uh, putting up a T-post for that and a disconnect, I think, is what we're going to end up doing just so that the kids don't have to worry about um, unplugging, unhooking, that kind of thing on the fence. See if this uh, conduit will work for a ground rod. It's what I had. dog pen set up and now we're gonna put them inside of it they look super excited don't feel loose yeah because they like you so much <laughs>
scout. Come. As always, we appreciate you guys' support and helping us reach 300 subscribers. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Pound that bell like Mike Tyson did in the 1980s. Next week, we'll have an update from our garden.